Well, welcome to another Humboldt Conversation. I'm here today with Jeff Davis, who's the project manager for the economic development with the City of Eureka. Jeff, welcome, welcome to Humboldt Conversation. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, thank you. Now, Uplift Eureka is a program within the uh, Eureka City Community Access Project. What are the goals of this program? Yeah, so the, the goals for Uplift Eureka are to um, provide access to the quality of life programming to connect uh, community members that are experiencing homelessness with vital services and resources within the community. Now there are a number of different programs. Um, tell us first about the Job Skills Training Program. Yeah, the Job Skills Training Program, it's a, it's a wonderful opportunity for folks to, who are interested in um, employment opportunities to get some hands-on training, some, some work experience, um, and really just, uh, it's a huge confidence booster and it really a, a resume booster as well. Mm -hmm. Now we actually talked to Sierra Wood, one of your colleagues, about the um, Pathway to Payday program yeah. that you just completed. That's been a big success for you guys. It's been a, a, a tremendous success. Yeah, we've been doing this program Program since I think it's 2015. Uh, we started off doing the Pathway to Payday uh, one time per year um, and this based on the demand and the success now we do this just about every other month. Now housing assistance is another key part of the, of the program. Yeah so we do operate a rapid rehousing program and that's really based on kind of grant funding and, and funding opportunities um, and so yeah it, it's a, a rapid rehousing program where we're able to um, search for and secure permanent housing for folks that are experiencing homelessness and then uh, provide them with um, supportive services and help them kind of stabilize and, and you know, get, get on, their, on, their, on their feet. Um, and we've had about over 120 folks uh, since 2019 that we were able to successfully house um, and um, do this really rapidly. We are great community partners with the uh, um, Humboldt County Department of Health and Human Services. We couldn't have done that without them. And so it's really a, a team effort. It's not just the city going in. We're just uh, the connections with the, with the, the county and with some local community-based organizations are just making all, all the difference. Now we're actually here in the Betty Kwan uh, Chin Center, and that, that's actually <laughs> one of your partners as well. Yeah. So Betty has been a, a, a tremendous tremendous partner with, with the City of Eureka, with a lot of our programming, with uh, some emergency shelters. Uh, we, we collaborate for, for food drives yeah, and food, <laughs> food distribution events. And so, yeah, Betty has just been, um, has such a huge impact on this community. And, and yeah, we've been, you know, uh, working with her every step of the way. Oh, I've never seen so much peanut butter in my life. <laughs> now, also, um, uh, it's not just about partnerships, because you also have a co-pilot scheme, which I thought was very interesting. Explain that for us. Yeah, guys. so the co-pilot program, it's uh, a program for, for community volunteers. So we um, recruit, train, and vet uh, local, uh, you know, uh, community members who are interested in, in helping those out that, that are in need. And it's more, uh, we connect them one-on-one. -on -one. It's more of like a helping hand to help folks kind of navigate uh, towards services or, or resources. Or it could just be someone that you meet with once a week just to kind of talk and, and, and someone that's, that's there for you. Um, we are going to be re-implementing that program very soon. Um, hopefully next month, um, we have a Uplift Eureka website, and then so if you're interested in the co-pilot program, definitely go to uplifteureka.com, and that's a great place to find information on, on all of our different programs. And the co-pilot system is, is a volunteer thing, it's, it's where you really are reaching out to the community to help support you. Yeah, definitely. It's an opportunity for, for folks to, to give back and, and you know help those in needs. If you see that there's an, a problem out there and, and if you want to know what you can do about it, the co-pilot is, is one opportunity for community members to, to give back. Wow. And as you say, they can get involved through the website. Yeah, yeah, the website, and there's um, information on, on all our different programs. Uh, you can either um, submit like a comment through the website, or there's some phone numbers. So if, if you're interested in, in the different programs, there's uh, specific numbers for each program. And we'll make sure that goes up on the screen as well. All right, thank you. Jeff, it's a real pleasure to meet you. I mean, Uplift Eureka is a, re a really vital part of our community. Yeah, it, it sure is. And we have our, our outreach team. We, have our, our, we conduct street-based outreach. We're out uh, five days a week. We're usually down at, at Free Meal conducting these services. And, Really, the outreach is, is the, the kind of the tip of the spear. They're the ones that are out there on, on the streets every, every day connecting folks with services, um, providing transportation, and is really building those relationships. And, and when um, housing opportunities or, or employment opportunities are, are uh, available, um, our out outreach team has just been at amazing with, with connecting folks with, with those services and resources. And they work very closely with, with the county and with other organizations, too. So um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a great program. It's been going on since about 2018, and uh, we're just uh, we, we work not just outside of the city, but within the city, too, uh, with our, our CSET team with the police department and our, our new uh, uh, care team. Uh, it's, it's just a, a great collaboration on, on so many levels. And we're actually going to be talking to Officer Le France uh, for a Humboldt Conversation next week. Oh, nice. Excellent. Yeah, we're looking forward to that. Good, yeah. Well, thank you so much for joining us for a Humboldt Conversation. It's a very exciting project. I'm really yeah. glad we had the opportunity to share it with our viewers and learn more about it. No, thank you so much for this opportunity and to, to get the word out and let more folks know about what, what, what the city's doing. Well, we certainly wish you all the best for the future. Great. Thank you. And thanks so much for joining us for another Humboldt Conversation. We'll see you again next time.